Hello there and welcome to my tutorials of Macromedia Flash Professional 8. In this video, we must talk about the various tools present on Mac Macromedia Flash Professional 8. So let's start off. So um, this is a selection tool. We can select various things using this like I made that circle and I had selected it. So this was a selection tool. Now we have sub selection tool. Using the sub selection tool, we can make customizations on the object. Like you can see various dots present here. I had selected using this whole oval using the sub selection tool, and these dots we can pull that dots like um, like here. So you can see the shape has changed. The sh uh, shape of that oval has been changed. Now we have the transform selection. Using the transform selection, we can um, make its size bigger smaller and just rotated it like I rotated it so this was the sub uh, transformation selection tool now we have gradient selection tool this tool is used for gradients like I had made that gradient circle see gradient is the blend of two colors like you can see red and black here so using the gradient tool I can um, make its position anywhere and I can rotate it and uh, do many things related to it. So this was the gradient selection tool. This is the line selection tool as its name suggests we can um, draw lines on our stage. This is the lasso tool. Lasso tool is used for um, making free selection on our stage like I made that circle. Now I can freely select this circle. In the selection and sub selection tool you select only in rectangular or in a square way so this was the lasso tool we have pen tool we can make shapes using pen tool like I had made that shape using the pen tool now we have the, the text tool we can um, write text on our document using the text tool now we have the oval tool using the oval tool we can make circles and ovals as its name also suggests only now there is the rectangular tool you can make rectangles using it now this is polystar tool you can make polystar and if you want to make um, stars so you can just click on properties there's property inspector and options and change its style to star now you can make stars on your stage so this was the polystar tool now we have the pencil tool we can um, draw things or shapes on our stage using the pencil tool as also its name suggests <laughs> the brush tool is same as the pencil um, nothing much to explain about it now we have the ink bottle tool ink bottle tool is used for making borders of uh, um, of our object like I selected this border and if I click on it you can see that border has been changed to green dark green so this was our ink bottle tool now we have fill tool using the fill tool we can fill in various things that I can select color and filled so this was the fill tool now eyedropper tool is used for selecting tools um, selecting colors sorry eyedropper tool like I selected the color has been selected here now I can customize uh, according to my um, wish rubber tool is for rubbing things as also its name suggests so this was a rubber tool these both are the colors we can use this pencil type for the borders and this for the filling so this was the basic introduction of tools in macromedia flash professional aid you may see that this video is boring but uh, good for beginners okay bye bye and have a nice day